Now I wonder, are these two different portals or are they linked somehow? I mean, it looks the same. <laughs> what? Kind of scared me. Okay, let's go back to the farm. I think we gotta have some plorts already there. So we can make new slimes. <laughs> that chicken is still alive! How? <laughs> Literally, how? <laughs> These guys should eat everything because of the pink slime. <laughs> this chicken has survived every single slime. This is a special chicken, I'm, I'm keeping it. <laughs> okay, let's go exploring new areas, I guess. Cause I think I already saw everything that is available here. Lada, поехали. Опа, загрузчика. Не, вот эта анимация это жесть просто. Starlight Strand, the vision of dusk and dawn together as one. Okay, so, so this is like the forest area that like is one of the first unlocked areas. In Slime Ranger. The Prisma waves seem to affect each area of the island differently, expressing a full spectrum of colors in some places, but alternating between or splitting the spectrum in others. And they actively change, sometimes quickly and constantly, others more slowly. In my first year here, every season looked different for me. To me. It was lovely while it lasted. Okay, so it's like seasons here. Also, I found the, the sore that I needed for something. So that, there are seasons in this game. Interesting. Bunk. Oh, honey slime. Honey slime. And rock slimes. Okay, this is interesting. So I'm guessing there's gotta be beetroot somewhere. Yeah, heartbeat, I think it's called. Heartbeat, yeah. Uh let's get rid of the carrots, I guess. And take the rock plot. Actually no, it's better to take rock slimes. Well, I need both anyway for the collection. Okay, what do we have here? More rock slimes. Slime statue. What is this? This is so cute! This looks so cute! <laughs> Is this a box? Are you supposed to destroy it? I don't want to destroy it. This is, this is so so cute. You can use this as a decoration. And I don't know if it's if it re responds. Ah, uh, okay. Well, if I f if I find another one, I'm breaking it. But for now, I want to keep it. Uh, dangerous area. Okay. There's a cave there. Okay, conclusion, you need a jetpack. So, let's go back. What? No! <laughs> well, good job me. I lost everything I had. 
Uh, jetpack. Oh, I need Phosphor Plorts and Radiant Ore. Yeah, for Radiant Ore I need Resource Harvester. Ten. Upgrade. Yes. Okay, I'll... Now I can mine ores. Oh, oh, there's utilities, warp tech, and decorations. There is no mining stuff anymore. I mean, I guess that's better. I do really like those. Okay, uh, I also want to get a, a power core. Yeah. And for that, I need more cotton plorts. Well, okay, let's then go and uh, mine some ore. Some radiant ore. Th these plorts look absolutely the same. I would say that's another issue. They look absolutely the same when they glow. This is what I don't like about new menu. You gotta scroll so much. And it's uh, limited as well. At limited speed. Uh, all of Rainbow Island's many oddities. Radiant ore uh maybe the most remarkable under a laser thermometer its temperature reads over 100 degrees celsius but it is cool to the touch and it becomes a nice liquid when melted interesting i almost fell down what is this mushrooms oh <gasps> hunter gordo i love hunter slimes okay i need uh, chickens then What is this new chi- Sea hen! <laughs> it's not a seagull, it's a sea hen. Lovable trash, like your favorite bad movie. Bruh. Old sailors say that sea hens are actually demons in disguise and they're vacant- and that their vacant expressions are Actually, a diabolically calculated misdirect to hide the evil intent, plotting, waiting for their moment to strike. Yeah, totally. Angular slime! That's a fish slime! Fish slime! Wow. Okay, well, I still... I'm still yet to find him, so... Okay, let's go back. I don't think there's uh, any more ore here. Okay, I'm going in. Ember Valley. The ancient world stirs beneath your feet with every step. This is definitely like glass desert. Is that a carrot? <gasps> Odd onion! I remember this. <laughs> This is the onion that grows like a carrot. I mean, in a field of carrots. I'm guessing it's favorite, but by some another slime. I don't remember who it was in the first game. Crystal slime? Either crystal slime or red slime. Uh, I got chicken stuck in inside the stone. Are you angler slimes or whatever? Yeah, angler slime. So pretty. Let me just get a closer. Okay, so it's a danger slime. I'm guessing. Angler slimes inhabit the deepest depths of the slime sea, but have 
now been discovered on Rainbow Island. It's not known what drew them from the darkest recesses of the far far range to what very well could be the most vibrant, but it may have something to do with the taste of a plump sun-kissed drumstick of a sea hen. Okay, and they eat meat and sea hen is their favorite food. I'll come back uh, for those guys later. Because I already have a new pair of slimes. Oh! Oh, that's a resource! Oh, okay, I see. So that's sand and those blue ones is something else. So honey is probably like the same. Oh, <gasps> but it's like new slime. Bad slime. Fiendish stalker of the night. Hungry and always for fruit. Betty slimes love to lurk in cold dark places like caves, swooping down from ceilings to scare others with their glowing red eyes and pointy fangs. No, they're not vampires. <laughs> the glowing eyes let, let lets them see in the dark. What? The glowing eyes lets them see in the dark is all. What? That doesn't sound like English to me. <laughs> they also greatly dislike garlic because they only eat fruit. Seriously. <laughs> Pomegranate. <laughs> Pomegranate. <laughs> Do I love these puns? Pomegranate. Okay, so we have another pair, pair of slaves then. Wait, why is it shaking? Why was there an earthquake just now? Weird. I think I need to build a silo. It will be useful for the new stuff that I find. Okay, jetpack, here we go. Now I have a jetpack and a power core. Let's try to feed the Hunter Gordo. Also, do I need another onion? I need a silo. <laughs> I definitely need, need a silo. Uh, let's buy an expansion, I think. If it's not too expensive. Is that a silo? Or is that just a decoration? No, that's just a part of... Conservatory. Uh, almost. I almost have enough. Wait, are there three expansions? What's here? Yeah, there are three expansions. Surrounded by tall rock formations and covered in amber grass. I think the best one would be the archway. Set amongst ancient ruins and fields of rainbow grass. I mean, some expansion gotta have that, like, uh, there are fruits growing there and stuff. Just like it was in the first game. But I, I don't know what... What to choose. The archway of the gully. Can I look over that? Oh, I have a jetpack though, I forgot. <laughs> and it still works just as in the first game. <clears throat> it allows to get up to certain height and that's it. You're pregnant? Oh god. 
Okay, so I see pretty much nothing because of this glow of the barrier. I mean, it does look pretty green. I think I'll go with the goalie. Bye. Yes. So what do we have here? An absolutely giant area. One, two, three, four, five. Five plots here. A chicken. Uh, a space chicken. The tide pools, a coastal sanctuary for coral life forms and seaweed. This expansion to the conservatory is guaranteed to fill your shoes with sand. Yeah, thanks, not today. <laughs> it's way too expensive. Okay, something epic is gonna <laughs> occur here. Oh, I found another this, of these things. Okay, is it a box? I'm guessing this is just a box. No! It's not a box. So it is like a decoration. Okay, that's cool. I wanna bring it back sometime. Oh, it show. Oh, I see. It even shows where the Gordo is. And yeah, it was in that area. Okay, this is cool. The map is really useful. And here is the Hunter Gordo. Yay! Still not enough? Damn boy, you big. Okay, where are the chickens? I need chickens. Also some new area with a lot of cotton slimes. What is that? Oh, that's, that's just a part of the map. I thought that was some new plant. And there's the map. E. Oh, oh, I skipped two parts. Maybe one part, but still. Okay, I thought that was for the entire area. But apparently I was wrong. Uh, I need a map. I found the honey gourd though. <clears throat> he leads into some cave. Okay. Uh, what does this be say? Ever since I came back, things have been a little fuzzy. Like some of my memories stayed behind. So I come here now to clear my head. I just let the sound of the falling water drown everything out and then in that white noise I can sometimes think clearly again. But then all I see is it happening again, so I take a few breaths, steady myself and get back to work. Something is weird is happening on this island. Oh, new message. What's this? Victor and Ogden. Okay, Victor. Beatrix, I've done it. I believe I've cracked the super mysterious code that was sent to me. It was astoundingly complex. I believe that the eye that created this code displays a comparable intellect to my own. So very advanced, almost alien. Oh, you're probably wondering what it said. Well, I determined this mysterious, perhaps even alien AI sent a message that says, Hello. Not much, but pleasantries count for something. <laughs> More importantly, the moment I cracked it, I received another message. 
It's almost as though this mysterious AI is monitoring me. How exciting. I haven't decrypted it yet, but the code is considerably more complex. This should be fun. Well, back to work as ever. Okay, well... Good job, Victor. Now we know that the... Some alien said hello to us. And that's good. Okay, Ogden, what do you say? Hola, Matrix, are you there? It's me, Ogden Ortiz. I hear you're off on a big new adventure on a mysterious island filled with secrets and danger, and maybe a few succulent fruits or veggies the world has never seen before. You know I had to ask. Ever since you got me a steady supply of cucadoba fruits, I've been reaching for even greater culinary heights within the far far range. Plus I'm getting pretty tired of eating cucadoba pie, cucadoba soffle, cucadoba pudding, cucadoba Con Kearney, Kukadoba Con... Kukadoba? <laughs> I'm running out of ideas. And willpower. So, if you see something new, please tell me about it. Tasty trees aside, I wanna know all about the new flora and fauna you discover. Never forget, every bit of this wild world is precious and worth our care and respect. And stay hydrated out there. Yeah, that's a good idea. All that eventually will work up a sweat, so take this water tap. Portable water tap? Good luck, Matrix. Keep me posted. I'm rooting for you. Of course he's rooting for me. Because he's a farmer. He's rooting for me. Ah, God damn it. <laughs> That's funny. That's a lot of chickens. And this is even without any upgrades. Dude, in the first game, check, chicken coops were like five times less efficient than this. Holy shit. Come on. Burst. Almost there. Yay. A lot of hunter slimes. I love hunter slimes, they're so adorable. That's so... That's a, such a wobbly plant. <laughs> okay. So what is this cave? Ooh. Ooh, that's interesting. What is this? Azure shrubs? Strange diamond! That used to be so rare. Okay, let's drop the honey slime. For now. What is this? And how do you open it? Maybe it opens from another side and this is like just a shortcut? I hope it comes back with me. Okay, nice. Because I don't know what else do you need this for? Other than a decoration. Oh, I found the map! Let's go! I found the map! Okay, there we go. Now it will be slightly easier. Okay. Now this door is open. Not this door? Then what door? Oh, they bite hard for 20 HP. Wait, then how do I open that door? Huh? 
I need to fly into that hole. I mean, I can do that. Oh, there's it. There it is. Wait, it's still not open. What? I'm confused. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> Why there are so many of them? This is like that one video that I did uh, five years ago. Блин, это просто жесть. Ну ладно, все ради видео. Капец. Uh, I don't think that's supposed to happen. <laughs> Please fix. So, maybe this door? Yes, there it is. And it's just a treasure pod. I mean, okay. Nova is Gordo Slayer. Yeah, I remember that. The giant mushrooms on this island are responsible for maybe the greatest botanical discovery of my life. Sorry, but it's a secret. Aww. But I wanted to know. Dude, this area is so big. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Oh, rip, rip. Hunter plort. Okay. This reminds me of uh, the ruined area. What is that? Oh, I don't have enough energy. What is that slime? That's a new slime. What are you? That's a butterfly slime. Flutter Gordo. Diet Nectar? Nectar? What? There's a new type of food? Or what? Or is that just a... What? A... Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Uh... We have a huge rift. Oh, <laughs> that scared me. Dude, that, that sound is like so... It's so loud. Puddle slimes. Yeah. Also, these are back. Cool. Uh... Yeah, sure, why not? Let's take them. Oh no, oh no, no, that chicken has been eaten. That chicken has gone to back rooms. <laughs> oh, he's following me. He's following me. What? They're feeding like on the on the trees, on the fruits. What? Okay, oh, <laughs> this is so much to take in right now. This is such a huge area. That's a giant statue. I want to take this. <laughs> okay, I gotta find the map for this area. Oh, there are Gordos. What is this? What is this Gordo? That's another new slime. Wait, is that? That can't be. Hold on. Are those statues are actually slimes? Ok, 
Okay, these ones are probably not. But like the, the cat one. Hold on, I need to experiment. Yeah, that's a gore. That's a slime. I thought that was just a decoration. That's an actual slime. What? That's insane. Okay. Uh, I got an idea. I'm not sure if this, this is gonna work, but I have an idea. No. I thought water would like... I don't know. Uh, uh, unpetrify him. Okay, so that's an actual slime. But how do I, like... Make him into a living one? Like, it's not even showing. Huh. It's like some brown cat slime. Wait, n no, that's not a cat, that's, um... Uh... Why... When there's a crime, there's a ringtail slime. Why did... What? I'm confused. Wh why did he just turn from a stone into a normal slime? Okay, I gotta... I gotta read about him. Ringtail slimes are nothing but trouble. Theft under cover of darkness is their favorite hobby, and they delight in getting away with it as much as possible before the sun rises. The reason for this exclusively moonlit crime spree is that ringtail... Ah, the reason for this exclusively moonlit crime spree is that ringtails have a peculiar condition that transforms them into stone when exposed to sunlight. Ah, I see. And while we're not saying this is an ancient curse, they're definitely the type of slime who would have an ancient curse if that was a thing. I see. Okay. So... I guess my decoration <laughs> at home is gone. It ran away. Oh, this is Moon Dew Nectar. This is for the butterfly slimes. Okay, now let's look at the Gordo. It's chickens. So... Wait, where was he? Oh, I made a mistake. I... I'm fucked. <laughs> I'm big fucked. No! Welp. Fuck. That's a shortcut for you. <laughs> Holy shit, that's a lot of chickens. Dude, I'm telling you, these chicken coops are insane in this game. Okay. That's that's it for today. This is way too much in, in one day. Okay. The game looks cool. Uh, we will uncover the secrets of this island uh, hopefully tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. We will continue playing this game and I will see you next time. See ya!